The year is 2030 and President Dwayne Johnson is impeached. What led to these events? People wised up and smelled what he was cooking. Unfortunately, it was meth. Does meth have a smell? I never really thought about that before. Edit. I no longer want to know the answer to this. Edit 2. Please stop answering. Edit 3. I wasn't kidding man. Pretty please. Edit 4. Why do you all hate me? If somebody's cooking at asterisk, the whole street can smell it. The smell is a bit like apples. And sour. And chemicals. Asterisk disclaimer. I think they were cooking meth. But didn't pop by to make sure. Paper? Little rock, paper, scissors joke for y'all. What does Arkansas have to do with this? The Clintons, of course, and a connection to the deep state conspiracy. He refused to take part in Fast and Furious 69. Fast and Furious 69 the final blow. This is one job they can't blow. Fast and Furious 69 Part 2, The Second Coming. The Big Show finds video footage that proves he actually won the election. But then his campaign is ruined by the conspiracy theory that he was born in France. As the son of Andre the Giant. So Triple H goes over. With the help of the New World Order. And the reign of terror begins again. If Triple H can run the country like he runs NXT, we're in for a good time. You mean nobody gets races and we don't do a damn thing when we get called up to the main roster? Blaming Triple H for wasted talent on the main roster is like blaming your old boss because your new boss sucks. Granted, I just read about the decline pay raises just now. So that really is shitty. Not gonna defend Triple H there. But I do wonder how much input he had related to that. He body slammed the vice president. No, no, we'll allow that. You'd allow Vice President Betty White to be treated this way? Question mark. After the beating she gave him, who can blame him for retaliating? The 31st Amendment to the Constitution has been made making the presidency a title belt and a course big match John Cena beat Rock at WrestleMania and is now the President of the United States of America. Impeachment, it is the new term for when you get thrown out of the ring and lose consciousness. Cena's finisher has changed with his gimmick before. The impeachment even fits pretty well. If a sitting president performs the same move, it's called the veto. They're going for the count. One, two, three, that's it. Three votes to impeach. Quote, he's safe. Junior, he's safe. I love it. The Rock is still the people's president. Quote, wait a minute, wait a minute. What the hell is this? The Chief Justice is still counting. That son of a gun. There are only three votes to impeach. And he's still counting. He's put 98 votes in the board already. Quote, just look at that evil grin on Vince McMahon's face. Quote, my God, this is a travesty. This is unlike anything we've ever seen before in congressional, wait. What was that sound? Quote, it's Vice President Stone Cold Steve Austin. Quote, by God, by God, I cannot believe my eyes. Vice President Austin is shaking hands with Vince McMahon. Oh, BP Austin just gave Justice Cena a stunner on the bench. Can't wait to read that dissent, Jr. President 316 says I just whooped your ass. The successful opposition campaign by Congressman Camacho. Edit. Thank you. Anonymous benefactor. I can't believe you like Reddit gold too. We should hang out. I know shit's bad right now. With all that starving bullshit. And the dust storms. And we are running out of french fries and burrito coverings. But we got this guy not sure. He's got a higher IQ than any man alive. Admitted that wrestling was fake. It's still real to me, damn it. It took me so long to understand what he was saying in that video. 
somebody smelled what he was cooking. He dropped the people's elbow on the Queen of England's Rudy Poop candy ass. She put up a good fight for a 103-year-old. Old Dwayne was never the same after she bit his left leg off and his right ear. Vince McMahon made him drop the presidency to Triple H of course. When he said, can you smell what The Rock is cooking, they did, it was meth, in the Oval Office. But the man got a lot done. The White House has never been so clean. Except he changed the name to Walter White House and had all the windows tinted blue. He was caught on camera with his VP, Kevin Hart, planning a sequel to Central Intelligence, based off of their time in office. Judging by your comments and upvotes on it, do people hate Central Intelligence? I know I liked it at least. I loved that movie, Emo It's Freaking Hilarious. I liked it partially because they did a good job at addressing the insecurity that follows you from your fat days, years after you got in shape, and also Kumail Nanjani's cameo. He turned heel on the American people and cut a presidential speech calling them all pieces of monkey crap. Fake news, Dwayne would never be impeached. I don't know. His rival in the polls during the last election, Congressman Jason Statham, would surely have enough clout and backing to generate an impeachment hearing. He told North Korea to cut it out before he kicks their candy ass. Because of a newspaper expose, you know that paper beats rock. President The Rock was booked to put over the up-and-coming politician, Brock Lesnar. He was eating too much pie. It doesn't matter what LED to these events. Subscribe for more hot Reddit takes in your inbox. Guaranteed.